is up, Trainters? Ludo here with another fabulous episode of Pokemon Go, and today we are down here at the fort for Pokemon Go Community Day, shunting, hunting, none other than shiny Chikorita. Shunting. That's what you call shiny hunting. Shunting. Anyways, we are down here today, and uh, some crazy things happened in Pokemon Go last night, if you were completely unaware. So, last night, after the Asian Pacific and Australia Community Days, all Pokemon turned into these little guys. Nobody knows what it is. It was discovered earlier in the day uh, in the APK mines and in the data mining for the game files attached to the Let's Go Pikachu stuff. So everybody was thinking that it was a Gen 8 Pokemon leak. Well, then it leaked into Pokemon Go. So nobody's really sure what it is because as soon as everybody started to catch it, it turned into Ditto. And then about a half an hour after that showed up, everybody started finding them and noticing they were Clacions. But then those started turning into Dittos as well. And on our way down here, we did find our own little, what I'm calling, Bolty. We got it, it still uh, turned into a ditto, and when you catch it, even though you've encountered it on your nearby, it still shows as a new encounter, like one you haven't encountered before, it's a shadow. So, very strange, very interesting, everybody's kind of confused on what's going on with Pokemon Go, and with the community day starting in like five minutes, uh, hopefully, you know, by the end of this community day, since we're the last region to do it, we'll see something big drop at the end of it. Maybe it'll all correct itself and it will be a Klaseon. Maybe. But, anyways, we have uh, some, uh, we have an Entei to catch, we have shiny Chikoritas to do, we have eggs to hatch, so let's get to the grind. Are you excited for Pokemon Go Community Day? Yeah! Let's go. just happened to all three of us. We caught that uh, Chikorita. Hers was shiny, mm. and then it turned into this stupid growl. Interesting. Even though I restarted my game. I just restarted my game. And then restarted it at 11. So the spawn should have been the spawn. Come to the road. Come here now. Interesting start. Well, we had videos. Okay, shiny on screen. 549 CP. Not that bad. Golden Raz. You know how we do. I always Golden Raz and Ultra Ball, my first shiny, if not all of them. Yay! Got it! Right, there is our little autumn time little Chikorita. It's so cute. Yay! Let's check the IV. Decent. Not that great, but still. Shiny Chikorita in the bag. Gonna hope to get some more because we gotta get some A shots, uh, AR shots for that, for one? sure. So, yeah. Super exciting. Brother's got one. The nephew doesn't have one yet. Tyler's got two already, I think. Our group's got a good amount so far. So, get back to the grind. See if we can find some more shiny Chikoritas. Not here, but let's go.
Alrighty, we are about halfway through the event. It is 12.30, just caught my fourth shiny, and we did catch two other shinies. I didn't get those on record, unfortunately, but here they are, 31 and a 390. Super exciting, four shinies so far, but I need to claim my Entei research because I just completed another Entei research, and I can't claim any of my other rewards until I claim the other Entei research. Niantic, you need to fix that. So, 1426 Entei. Hopefully we can catch this pretty quick and easy so that way we can get moved on. Will you hold this? Okay, there we go. So now we can uh, claim our other reward, get our other Ente, and that way we can actually claim all these other rewards because Niantic makes it to where you have to claim all that stuff first. See, I have to claim this breakthrough. Impressive button. Just so that way I can claim these other rewards. Okay, shiny check. Oh, uh-huh. Shiny, shiny, shiny check. Not a shiny, okay, so. We're gonna continue the hunt, of course. Uh, we've got our group has split up. They're up there doing a Mewtwo raid and we're down here by the fort searching for more Chikoritas. So, I've got four, she's got five, he's got two, he's got four. So we've got a small little group of shinies here. Pretty awesome, exciting. I have to admit, shiny Chikorita is damn adorable. Damn adorable. So, so, we're gonna head down to the fort as per usual and see what we can find down there. Let's go. Okay, so we're at where this little clinky thing is, but I have uh, 7K of eggs hatching, so hopefully we'll get a Kangaskhan and then we'll get this little clinky thing. Diglett, not a Kangaskhan. Okay, uh, three out of four of the first egg hatched. It was a Grimer you didn't see, you didn't need to see, and this is a Kangaskhan, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> ah, I just completed my decks. I wanna cry. Simply amazing, defense, excellent, sweet. I just completed my Dax. And we have one more egg hatching. Be another Kangaskhan, that'd be cool. Yeah. A Tauros. Okay, where's Mr. Oh, I have more than, I thought I had less than that many eggs hatching. I guess I have more. Where's the Clanky Clank? Over there. Over there. Mr. Adorable, little, random, new, unnamed, unidentified Pokemon. Oh, there it is, it's so tiny I can barely even see it. Okay, well, now that the damn screen is recording, look, it's so tiny, I can barely even see it. Okay, so, where do I want to AR this? Let's just AR it over here really quick, because I do want to get AR of this little guy. That way I can say I at least have one. Okay, drastic angle here, but uh, let's get this little AR going. Ah, it's so cute. It's so tiny. Okay, that's, that's enough for AR shots. Let's catch the little guy. Do you guys see he has a little electric tail? It's super cute. A little wire tail. And we're at seven minutes left of community day. Seven minutes left. And there you go, it turns into a ditto. What do you know? Two or three. You got another one? Yeah, Finally got his third shiny. I did. 
Praise Jesus. <laughs> and I hatched a Kangaskhan. Did you do it? So I completed my decks. Nice. Sorry, Katie. Let's, let's shiny check all these. Maybe I can get a last seven minutes shiny. All right. Not a shiny here, not a shiny there. And that's not a shiny either. I'm not gonna and that's not a shiny either. And then she has 11. Like, <laughs> that's really good for a uh, normal community day. <laughs> All right, got our clanky clank little guy. I lost count. Shiny check that one. No. So we got our little clanky clank guy. And uh, we have, I think, nine or ten shinies. I think we have nine. And then we, we hashed our Kangaskhan. You guys didn't necessarily see that because it wasn't recording. But you saw the excitement, and that's what matters. <laughs> But yay, Kangaskhan hatched, uh, multiple shinies caught, and a new clanky clank little Pokemon that turns into Ditto. How exciting. So unless I catch another shiny before the next five minutes is up, we will just see you back at home to close out the episode and, you know, do what we normally do. Exciting. See you at home. Okay, the event is over and look, Clinkic, Clinky, Bolty, Nutito, whatever you want to call it, is everywhere. But I can't click on any of them. Tiddo. Oh, there's one we can click on. Let's get this nut tiddo. These little nut tiddos are very interesting. I mean, and it happened for all. It happened for the Asia Pacific. It happened for the UK. And now it happened for us. So it's on purpose, y'all. It is on purpose. But I do still think it was a, a purpose accidental thing. Or an accidentally purposeful thing. Either way, they're really tiny, they're really cute, and they're really hard to click on. So, you know, maybe by the time that we get home, there'll be some information on the Twitter worlds to see what's going on. But for now, community day is over. Shiny, check this Geodude. No. So, we will uh, see you back at home again. Officially, for real, now. All right, we are home, and can we just look at this? I would like to thank the Academy. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I finally hatched my Kangaskhan and our Kanto Dex is finally complete. 84% with low kick and crunch and it came from Taiwan. Super happy, super satisfied with that. 84% IV. Zoom, zoom. And there we have it. The completed, finished, and full Kanto Dex. Ermagird. Ermagird. Also, Ermagird, we caught 10 shiny Chikoritas. Aside from Eevee Day, which was two days, that is the most we have caught in a community day. Plus, I have heard much success across the board. And of course, you know, you do hear your bad stories and, and that's just how the game goes because it's all based on luck and, and numbers. But I heard a lot of success and we had a lot of success. So I'm really happy. The only thing we forgot to do was evolve them in time to get the move. And yeah, that's a total bummer. It, it, it's more of a novelty item, especially since it's not actually a good move. It doesn't make Meganium any, it doesn't change anything. But we cannot expect every community day to just be like, oh, here's the next great Pokemon with the next great moves, and here's the next great Pokemon with the next great, we can't. Because the next great thing is this, uh, what I'm calling Natito, the little nut bolt, electric tailed, dittoed, silvered, chrome looking, new Pokemon that nobody has any idea about really other than all of their theories they can come up with. All we know is, is it's still around, it still shows up as a shadow, and it still turns into Ditto. So to get away from the turning into Dittos, let's turn some of these Chikoritas into some Meganiums. Even though we didn't get it for the move, uh, we're gonna do it because so I'm gonna evolve one of my 10 CP ones because I always love doing that. For one, because I like having like a really small CP'd team of shinies that I like to use against like the tier one raid level bosses that have the shiny possibilities. I feel like it kind of gives me some shiny luck in there, you know? Ooh, a little, a little terracotta bay leaf. This leaf is kind of like a bronzy, metallic-y, greeny, I don't know, moving on to Meganium. 
It's shiny. So, yay. Shiny meganium. It's so pretty, really. I mean, meganium itself is really pretty, but... Gotta love those orange leaves. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, I didn't think it was gonna be that low CP. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Well, there you go. The best meganium in the world right here, ladies and gentlemen. And then the other one that we're gonna do all the way to meganium is this one. It's my highest CP'd Chikorita. So then that way we can at least have a high CP'd meganium, unlike our 39 CP'd meganium. Uh, terracotta metallic green bay leaf again. It's a good thing I have plenty enough candies. We had over a thousand candies and we caught over a hundred Chikoritas. So, uh, the, the spawns were insane. I did a lot of the fast catch stuff, so it was just like racking them in. And I didn't use a lot of pineapple berries, so that was all a lot of authentic candy. Uh, 1775 that looks a lot better we will invest in powering that one up just a little bit not too much I don't like my shinies to be uh, like super CP'd unless they have a really good IV as well and then of course we always need a bay leaf because you that's like the goal of all community days is to get the three so that way you can at least have the three forms unlike uh, uh, EB community weekend where you had to get what was it? Nine? Yeah, something like that. Anyways, terracotta metallic green bay leaf again. I actually like it a lot. Uh, it's getting named terracotta. There we go. Terracotta. Yeah. And then one more I would like to get meganium because that 29 CP one was rather disappointing TBH. So uh, we're gonna hope to get at least like 11, 1100 meganium. Ooh, we may not even make that. We might only get like 900, 800, and that would be fine. I kinda like that level. It's good, good against those uh, tier ones for possible shinies. Here we go, our shiny meganium. Orange leaves are gorgeous. Oh my god. 769. Not bad. I'm I'm satisfied with that. I like that. Ooh, it was a fine whip and solar beam. So stab already instantly. So good to go in gyms for tier one raids that have shiny possibilities, because that's what I do. So there we go, we have our shiny family. Oh. But yay, super happy fun, autumn time, community day with Chikorita. It is really pretty. I do like the shiny Chikorita family. It's a very autumn-y, the, the colors are very warm and I like that, so. Yes, other amazing things happened on this day, but you know, enough of the spotlight has been taken from Chikorita and, and this day is about Chikorita. Her sassy self in that anime would not let this happen. So, wash your back and watch out for uh, Celebi. The, the closing of the Celebi should be coming soon. I'm just trying to find the perfect place to do it. But when we do, you will be the first to know. So stay tuned for that. We're also gonna be going out and doing a Mewtwo day. I have done some Mewtwo raids. Uh, already, but uh, they were anything good for one. But I do want to go out and do a full like Mewtwo day where it's just like non stop Mewtwo, 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 Mewtwo. Because I do want to go out and do a full day of like just Mewtwo raids. Like that will be super fun. Totally hoping to get a Hundo because I do not have a Hundo Mewtwo. I am so close to a Hundo Mewtwo. So we need to go out and get that Hundo Mewtwo. So stay tuned for all that coming. For now, please scroll down. Give me that like if you truly did enjoy this. Maybe consider subscribing if you're not. And if you are subscribed, be sure to hit the notification button next to the subscription button so that way you're notified of the next adventure. And we'll see you then, Trainters. Stay fabulous. Bye.